What's up you guys, it's Dr. Buck Parker and in this video I want to review a book that I think is essential, a must have for any future physician or physician or resident. You guys gotta know this book and it is The House of God. I've talked about it before. The reason you gotta read this is because this is a book that could not be written now. All right, this was written in 1974 and it tells a story of an intern and all the that he goes through and had it almost goddamn near ruined his life. But it also talks about all the crazy shit that he does, which is like sleeping with the nurses and drinking on the job and all the things that you could never fucking say in today's society. I have got stories like this book, but there is no goddamn way I would be able to say anything because I would be hung by the fucking whoever. I wouldn't be able to keep a job if I told you guys the stories that I saw and did in residency. This is a pretty, pretty close <laughs> representation of residency and how it used to be and sometimes how it still is. Uh, so it's very interesting and honestly, I have to say it gets a little repetitive like the punishment and everything and by the way He was a medical resident like my residency was way f harder than this he, he he kind of he kind of describes like how much torture it is and it is torture Residency's hell, but mine was way worse and I'm not sure if that it wasn't that bad Like he didn't have a lot of patience or it just like he, he couldn't describe it quite correctly anyway it's a very good book in it and it gives you a great insight into first of all residency like what it's like kind of you know doing every day and what kind of punishment you take and who the characters are going to be in residency so it's, that's kind of neat and so it also talks about something that I really like in it that is the care that we give to people that is basically futile and I have a like a big issue with this I did a I did another video that was called like death panels and I talked about how we should have death panels because we give people care that's futile and really we're just torturing them and then spending the money and it wasn't maybe some people didn't really quite get it uh, I know some, a lot of you guys did but uh, my, my point in that is that is uh, we hurt people you know you can in medicine there is no Disease surgery cannot make worse is what we say and if you uh, do surgery on somebody that their Outcome is going to be the same whether they get surgery or not uh, If we treat them or not their outcome is still going to be death or misery or disease or whatever it is Then why are we torturing this person and then spending the money for it? So that's why I said it But this guy talks about that a lot in here and so he really explains it really well also So I really like it the other thing I was gonna say is like the whole book I probably wouldn't read the whole I read the whole book Book, and it's like eh, the middle is like meh, but the first half is good and the other thing you can do is if you don't want to read the book you can get on audible.com uh, I use audible.com like crazy I always uh, basically don't read books anymore well these kind of books I use audible so that way like when I'm driving I can listen to books you guys check that out I'll put the link uh, below in this video and uh, let me know what you think of the book if you have read it and your own review would be awesome and then if you get it and then read it then comment come back and comment and tell me how you liked it all right Thanks, you guys. Take care. Share, subscribe, like, comment, all that stuff. All right, see you in the next one.